Hello there bandits and welcome back to our parents guide series. Today we're going over another sporting great and we're delving right into Madden 17. It's clear from the outset that this year's Madden release is a much polished beast. We've got to admit, as with all yearly titles, Madden has fallen a little by the wayside for us with the usual graphical updates and not much else. However, this year's Madden has made some key changes to the ways you can play and it really does make a difference. They've made some vast improvements to offense, defense and special teams as well as providing much improved zone coverage which helps a little to balance the passing game. And if all this seems a little like a foreign language to you, don't worry because they also provide a great and in-depth tutorial where you can bring yourself up to speed on the new controls and test yourself against the AI. The biggest changes have to be in franchise mode this year with the all new play the moment mode you can skip through the mundane play by play and only jump into the game, or choose to simulate, when the big game defining moments happen. Skip those lacklustre first downs and take yourself right to the end zone, or, of course, you can choose to play every moment on the pitch. With much more control through the franchise and big decisions to be made, it really puts you in the hot seat. You might have an all-star quarterback, but if he's got a lingering injury, do you really want to risk him in a spot in the playoffs on the horizon? Or are you going to go with the complete unknown from the back benches? Madden 17 is officially rated by Peggy at 3, but we'll run things down for you here. Online 4. As with usual online modes, just watch out for other players here and obviously make sure your settings are restricted if you so choose. Violence 3. The game is pretty much centred around huge men running into each other. While there's no fighting in the title, it is definitely a contact sport. Gambling 1. And there's no monetary reward of course, but the new franchise mode does mean your big decisions hinge mostly on lady luck and everything hangs in the balance. Sex, fear, drugs, discrimination and language all get zero, having no part in Madden 17. Certainly one for the older children here then, mainly as the strategies and controls may be a little complex for those of a younger age, but what about us dinosaurs? Graphics 9. To be entirely fair, this was going to receive a 10 from us until we saw one of the players with long hair. Apart from those, the rest of the graphical cutscenes and play are beautifully polished. Story 6. This one surprised us a little really. A sports game with a story? What's going on? The franchise mode revitalizations have really given this a boost and with the control you get over your season and the fact that you can shape your own way to a large extent, it scores very highly for a sports title. Sound 8. As we'd expect, there's a solid soundtrack to Madden this year, which doesn't really break any trends. The sounds in-game are crisp and clear, and after a good while of playing, we've not heard too much repetition from the commentary team, which can sometimes be a worry with sports titles. Replayability 8. I'm not sure why, but we usually get a little hooked on Madden, and this is something which just keeps drawing us back in for one more game. Madden 17 excels a little further here, as the play the moment mode makes it even easier to drop in and out of the game when you have limited playtime. Satisfaction 9. We're really enjoying Madden this year, and with the changes that have been made it feels much less like the copy pasta of old titles, the graphics and sounding game really pull you in and put you on the field yourself. We'll be on this for some time, so get a comment with your gamer tag below if you want to challenge us on the field, and we'll see you in the end zone. That's it from us today, Bandits. Don't forget to check out our full extended review at pixelbandits.org, and of course you can subscribe here and there to keep up with our reviews and the previews moving forward. As ever, we've been Pixel Bandits, and you have been awesome. Thanks for watching.